We'll guide you through how to install texture packs, also known as resource packs, in Minecraft. If you find this guide useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. A texture pack can completely change the look of Minecraft. So first of all, we need to go and download a texture pack. Go and open up a web browser. Now you may already have a pack in mind. If you do, that makes things super easy. You can simply go and search for it and download it. However, if you want to go and browse for one, which I'm going to go and do, a site I like to use is called Modrinth, but there are many other reputable sites out there as well. So come to the site. Once you're here, you can go and hover over Discover Content at the top and then select Resource Packs. As I said, they're also known as that from Texture Packs. And then what you can do is go and scroll through here and you can start to go and see the different packs that are available. Before we get any further, a big shout out to the sponsors of this video, Apex Hosting. They should be your go-to place for a Minecraft server. At the moment, you can get 25% off your first invoice. So if you're interested, I'll put a link down below. They've got so many awesome features and benefits, like one click install mod packs, DDoS protection, 24 seven servers and support, so you can go and get the help anytime you need it, ultra latency and so much more. So check them out. To continue with the guide though, go and find a pack you like the look of. For example, in this case, I'm going to go and get Faithful 64. Once you're here, you want to go and click on versions. Now you're going to go and see different versions here. If you're playing on a certain version of Minecraft, go and get that. So in this case, I'm using the most up to date, which is 1.21.3. So I can then come over to the right and click on the download button. And like so, it's now downloaded. After you've downloaded the pack, of course you can download other packs as well, then what you need to do is come and return to Minecraft. So here we are, let me go and bring it back up. So in Minecraft, all you need to do is you can either go into a world and do this and pause the game and click on options, or from the main menu, just click on options, then click on resource packs. And in here, you need to click on open pack folder. So this is where you need to go and add your texture pack to. So you may need to go and open up another file explorer to do so you can right click on it and then click on file explorer and another will open. I've already got one here. And so then all I need to do is go and find the pack, which is this one here, faithful. Yours will be called something different potentially. Then all you need to do is click hold and drag it in. When you do that, it should then go and appear in Minecraft as you can see. And so then all you need to do is go and hover over it and to go and then start using it and add it, you need to click on the arrow over to the left here and it'll go and add it. Make sure it's at the top of the list. Then you can press done. Minecraft will probably go and reload. And as you can see, we're now using the pack. If you want to go and turn it off as well, all you need to do is come back here, hover over and click on the arrow to go and remove it. But now let me get into a world and show you how it looks as it looks super cool. As you can see, it completely changes the look of Minecraft. Each pack is gonna go and make the game look different as well, which is super cool. There are so many different texture packs out there available as well, depending upon the theme you want, whether it's medieval, modern, or whatever you want. If you found this useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. We've got a lot of Minecraft content on the channel and more to come.